everybody, it's Lucinda from The Bees Needs. It's a beautiful sunny uh, Monday morning here in New England. My daughter and I just got back from England on Saturday. Thank you to all of those of you that followed along with our posts and videos, it was fun. Um, I have more photos to share, but I'll do that over the next few days. It was wonderful for my daughter and I to have the time with my mom who um, did great and we had fun discovering London and just spending time together, it was really special. Um, and I, well, the tins all arrived before I went, I think you know, and people have been ordering, but um, I didn't do a live for them. And then I got back and um, Trish had unpacked all the <laughs> new Emma Bridgewater stuff that arrived while I was away. And though Donna and Trish were here yesterday and we unpacked and organized, so now I can introduce it to you. We've been waiting for it to come. So we're really excited. There's some beautiful new stuff in their spring summer range um, that we think you will love. Um, so let's get started because I've got a lot to show you. So some ranges have been added to the architecture range. There's the dome caddy and the um, um, a rectangular tin and this is a lovely tray, with what they call the deep well tray, the tin trays. They're quite sturdy. And also in the new buttercup design, which we have the tin, the buttercups. This is the new insects and flowers or buttercup range, I think they call it. There's pottery to come soon to go with this, mugs and plates. It's their new Easter spring range, beautiful. So we have the tin and the tray, and then these cool insect mugs, the ladybird or ladybug, depending on where you're from. Do you say ladybug or ladybird? The grasshoppers and the bee, which we love, of course. So that's the, they're all brand new together with the clover flower one, which is lovely. And the, um, this wasn't to wholesale previously, you could get it on their website, but um, now we have the, um, the daisies with the green background. So they all mix and match really nice, as always with Emma Bridgewater, you can mix and match really well. We also have the for forest, oh my gosh, sorry, Florence Nightingale. It is the, um, a celebratory mug of her. She was born in, um, she died in, she was born in 1820 and died in 1910. So that's a pretty special, um, it's a bicentenary, sorry. The jet lag's still happening here, <laughs> 1820 to 1910. So it's the Florence Nightingale Bicentenary Mug um, with all information about her. So that's a nice collector's items. A uh, couple of new dog mugs to add. The Yellow Labrador, might have to have this because of Shelby, and the Beagle, so they're always popular. And then now these brand new, all brand new here. So wonderful, there's a River Shore, there's a Freshwater, and a salt water, two different ones. So for people who like the beach, the seaside, fishing, they're lovely. Then we've got the brambles and the th brambles and the thistle mugs, which are different. And then these are called um, dream homes. This is a, your dream home is a fisherman's cottage. I love the decoration inside. My dream home is a fisherman's cottage. Or my dream home is a cottage, keeper's cottage in a bluebell wood. Just adorable. Lots of dogs around the inside there. Just beautifully illustrated mugs. And then dream landscapes. This one is the Cornish Beaches one. Beautiful. So the ever popular flower mugs. We always have flower mugs. People love them, collect them. So there's three brand new flowers this spring. Um, the blue irises. The uh, rose, red rose, beautiful and the red and enemy so if you collect the flower mugs these are three brand new ones to go with that collection and again brand new range for the spring is the pink roses just lovely um so we have i think almost the entire range we've got the big four mug teapot they're great for a crowd the large cup and saucer both of these come in their box in the boxes so make nice gifts the half pint mug the ten and a half plate, ten and a half inch plate, the eight and a half inch plate, and the cereal bowl, soup bowl. You can use it for whatever you like. And the beautiful three pint jug for flowers or anything really. Punch at a party. And then this lovely milk jug that says true love and roses. So you could get that in time for Valentine's Day, probably. So that's the new pink roses. Gosh, there's so much here. Um, this is the strawberries. And again, in the phase two launch, there will be pottery to match the strawberries. So the set of three cake tins 
which is beautiful for storing cakes, cookies, crackers, whatever you want, prize winning strawberries. Just so bright and cheerful. The rectangular tin and the biscuit barrel can use for tea bags or these have a nice, as you can see, seal on them so you can keep your biscuits and cookies fresh in there. And then there's also this, these come as a set of three in a in the presentation box like this. Um, again, tea bags for anything really, which is lovely. Lovely set of canisters, sugar, tea, coffee, whatever, whatever you feel like. So much new stuff. So for the book bird lovers out there too, this goes nicely with the river shore, a hinge lid tin with lots of different birds on. Um, and for the dogs, a lovely treat tin. So that's nice for the dogs. So in their aim to be environmentally friendly and our aim, we do try, as I say, I think I told you before, we reuse packaging. All this pottery comes with lots of packaging. We reuse it. Um, we don't throw it all away. We friends recycle bubble wrap with us. So we really like to um, reuse that. So Emma Bridgewater has these new travel mugs, which have already been selling. So I'm going to read to you what it says. The Emma Bridgewater travel cup is made from rice husk, which is a natural byproduct of rice milling. That means it's very eco-friendly and it will happily biodegrade on your compost heap in just 90 days. However, they are um, dishwasher safe, BPA free, uh, microwave safe, top rack of the dishwasher. So completely reusable with the lid. Um, so that's a really nice new addition. They come in the nice gift box. So we've got the black toast, polka dot, the blue stars and the pink hearts. Again, another lovely Valentine's gift, the pink heart would be. Um, we have back in stock, or they reintroduced the black toast biscuit barrel, which has always been very popular, and the classic polka dot one, um, which wasn't around for a while, but now that's available too if you collect the classic polka dot. Along with, we've got the linens back, which we're excited because they weren't available for a while. Um, a tea towel, an apron, um, an oven mitt, and a double oven glove. Um, in the polka dot and three egg cups um, which come in a nice box so at polka dot was one of the very I think it was the absolute original range and it still goes strong and it's nice to have other items to add to the collection something else new and really fun is this what they call a jam jar um, it does come in three sizes but we only have this size available to host wholesale at the moment so that for flowers or just for putting in you could put jam in or serve anything in it, but it's just really cute and different, um, the black toast jam jar. Okay, we're getting there before I run out of breath. Back to the um, buttercup and, and insects, this lovely set of three canisters, they come in a nice um, container like those together with the daisy, the th so also with the hinge lid, if you, if you use loose leaf tea, these would be great or storage rice and grains and things in your pantry but really make um, a nice collection the three of them together and to add to the vegetable garden range um, are these stackable so they all stack inside each other but for again trying to be eco-friendly have your snacks in these rather than plastic bags they're very nice top rack of the dishwasher safe so that's a popular vegetable garden range which the strawberries and there'll be lemons coming things will be added very soon so our uh, Bridgewater is popular we like to have as much of it we can because customers are always asking for different things and finally we're excited again as I said to have the textiles back um, so the very popular the crown we have the crown mug there's a tea caddy which we should be getting more in very soon the hinged tin so there's this beautiful um, tea towel now to go with that range which I know several lots of people have bought the, the tea caddy so that's a nice addition to that to go with the dog mugs <laughs> lovely dog tea towel all different breeds on there and they're all 100 percent cotton wash really nicely and then for the new um under the sea river shore range this one for by the sea if you live by the sea or have a beach house um another tea towel so there's more to come there's more from the tins to come because Things just seem to come in stages um, and we look forward to introducing all that to you. We also have some brand new Sophie Allport, which we are 
adding to the website as we speak and we'll be introducing that to you soon. Also some fun new tins and new designs from Sophie Allport. Um, we've just secured another designer who we'll be introducing this year. So lots going on at the bee's knees. Thanks for being there for us. And as I say, for following along in England, that was fun. And hope you have a great day and let us know if you have any questions. Um, info at the bee's knees at britishimports.com or message on Facebook or Instagram. And um, yeah, hope you love the new stuff. Let us know what you think. Thanks. Bye.